not over here. I, I don't even like you. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm like, dude, I don't even like you. I even want to go any farther with this. I don't know. Maybe you got to call another record company or something. What's up, everybody? FSC Trucking. We're getting ready to pull off over here in Amsterdam, New York. Our two miles our exit. We're getting ready to pick up this wreck end dump, or at least make the attempt to figure out if and how we can finagle it on my trailer and take it out to Minnesota. It's going out by the Twin Cities area up in that direction. We brought a generator and a trash pump, you know, those big water pumps, out to Massachusetts. Now we're in upstate New York trying to figure out how to pick up this end dump. Let the fun and games begin. to the cell phone so it's front end's pretty messed up so yeah that's what I figured the gears are dug into the ground a bit so it's gonna be hard to get an accurate measurement looks like they were up when it wrecked so that's a good sign the back's the scary part she is tall I stand six feet. Yeah, that's what we got. Basically, it'll sit like I said, 
the funnel overhang eight feet off the tail this can ride right against the top deck I don't think it'll go any it won't go any other way so the landing legs would land on my back deck the landing legs would land on my back deck these would land on the trailer but the overall height let me check that one more time Yeah, that ugly mess right there. That's not a little one, that's a heavy No, that's a heavy girl. Problem is, it's gonna be a little tall. We got to load it. Are you the guy I talked to on the phone? Yeah, so we gotta load it backwards. The wheels are gonna go against my front, you know, my gooseneck. And the landing legs, they sank in the mud. But it, it'll that'll ride right on my back deck. It should be still under 14 feet, so. Yeah, but how am I gonna get that on your trailer? I gotta, I gotta lift the whole thing. Hey, unless you can lift end to end, if you can get the wheels on it, and I lift the front. Let me get back. Though. Okay. Yeah, the record man's already aggravated because the guy that paying us to move this, remember I said he's hard to deal with? Yes, yeah, so he got the record man all pissy. And he knows it ain't me, it's just, I don't know if that's a rotator or not, kind of looks like it. You know what, I should have looked inside. There better not be any load in it. We really screwed. Ugh. It's full of water. I don't know if you can see that or not. Here. Now, did you drag this in by chance? What? Did you drag this in by chance? No. It'd be nice if you did. Uh, it's got like too much crap in it, but it's got a lot of water in it. Because how it's sitting. It's not too much crap. What's the metal in there? Nah, it's like leaves and shit. Hey, how's it going? Oh, how you doing, buddy? Hi. Well, I got soaked unloading yesterday, so I put in my wet time this week. It's <laughs> 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 old. I hear you. One of these brakes are Oh, 
what the truck looked like after it did that. Oh, sure. You had a lot of stuff drugged in here in the past week, haven't you? A lot of stuff drugged out, too. <laughs> What's that? A lot of stuff went out, too. Yeah. Thank God, a lot of campers. Who's bringing all the heavy stuff in? Um, Stearns. He brought one in, but it's mostly been, is it Value? Value Auto from towards Utica. Yeah. And then, uh... How about Interstate? No. No? Uh, some guys up in Queensbury, they came down yesterday. You know what I'm talking about. Go away. Oh, yeah, they were here yesterday. Yeah, I saw them before. They brought that car home. Over. Two are, two are not. Cage of bolts. Front two are caged, the back two are not. No. Nope. I guess they're like, we're not crawling under to get the cage and bolts, we'll just get the two that are easy. Yeah, man, when you called me pissed off, I knew it. You, you would oh, talk. To, I knew you got a hold of that clown. <laughs> I, told, I told dispatch, I'm like, listen, because he's the one paying us. I'm like, if he wasn't paying us what he's paying us, I tell him to go f himself. I'm done. Because oh, I, I, I'm like, Okay, you want me to haul this? Well, I don't know if you can. Okay, how big is it? I don't know. Yeah, he's a and he sends me a picture. It's a picture of the auction on his phone. And it's the greeniest picture. I'm like, because he's like, well, you don't know what an end dump is? I'm like, really? So, yeah. Yeah, I've talked to him too. I'm like, I know what an end dump is, but I know they're all different shapes and sizes too. Can I get a rough estimate on the height of this damn thing? He knows that you know, everybody's coming here is measure just thing for the guy. He knows he's just a big guy. Because that's the thing with him. I, I told you, like, we'll go out there and look at it. I'm in Massachusetts, pal. If I don't take this load, I go down to Carlisle, Pennsylvania. It's kind of the wrong way. Yeah. I saw the picture. I'm like, uh, I kind of sat as roll the dice. <laughs> Let's just see. And I called dispatch and I'm like, well, if I got a permit for the height, we're going to stick off the ass out of my trailer eight feet no matter what we do. I'm like, well, who's paying the permit on it? He's like, well, it's why it's paying like that. Okay. Well, how's it loading? Well, I think he's, he's got he's to deal with the wreckers or something. Because one time, I guess we moved some for him, but we, we called the wrecker and went to bill him and then he was pissy. Like, well, we had to deal with part of the auction with the wrecker. And I'm like, so we're like, we just call him. So I... I got you know I got his number off you. Yeah. I call I call him and I'm like all right, well, let me go find out who's paying the bill. Call dispatcher like yeah, you gotta have stuff over. I was his company. I didn't even know it at the time. He's like yeah, call him and he's got to call a record. So he gave me the same exact number. Yeah. So I'm like all right, well apparently he's like well I can't move until I hear from him. I'm like all right, well, that's cool. I, I get that. I mean he ain't gonna work for free. And then he calls, he's like, and, uh, he didn't like that, but he was like, yeah. I'm not moving until I get hurt this guy. Cause the guy literally called answers like, I can't do it right now, I'll call you back. I'm like, really? Yeah, that's what he does. I'm like, he's fuck. But yesterday with me, it was, it was, I'm trying to get information and he's dealing with somebody on a walkie talkie. Yeah, and you can't you tell, and you don't know who he's talking to. Is yeah, he talking to you? Is he talking to the other guy? Get talking to you, you idiot. And he got mad at me yesterday and hung up on me. I'm like, oh boy. Yeah, he's one of them. Yeah, well, I know we've moved stuff for him. This is the first I've dealt with him, but we've moved stuff before and his check's cleared. So I'm like, yeah. I just keep thinking that. Yeah. But I told dispatch this morning, I go, my patience is thin. It's already been thinned out. So I was like, oh, great. Now I got a pissed off record guy mad at me. <laughs> I'm like, well, I ain't do it. <laughs> Yeah, I hate 
I don't think anything's come apart. I think it's just bent. Oh yeah, look at that. Ain't nothing left of that. Yeah, well, it, it hooked into that notch, so it ought to be. Oh, and it is about like two feet of water in it. Well, it's sitting downhill for so long. You said I'm number seven to come look at it, so. <laughs> Which is almost frightening. I'm like, why is it me the only one with the big enough stones to haul this shit? It should not. No idea. Really? About here? I'm already 26,000. This ain't good. Oh, well, got a drill. I don't have to bend my fucking siphon hose. Can you suck it in to make it a little easier? I don't like to get in this. Room. I hear you. Dude, it sank in the ground. I don't know what some cables work. Hook it at that and yank them up. Imagine water coming out of that. That's also my like, just lift it up high enough, get that water out. Yeah, just by the amount of damage on that bar, I figure it was loaded when it crashed. I don't know, maybe it'd be worse if it was, I don't know. Because there's like some leaves and crap in the front, but it's it's got water in it all the way up to the level of the gate. You're gonna go heavy or something. So you're gonna go heavy or something gonna go go boing -o. Oh, it tells you to wait? That's useful. It's moving. Everybody's running for cover. Water starts to come out. There she is. Open that back in. Great. There you go, perfect New York Bottom one, I like moving at all. That's tight. Nice. Niagara Falls. Got a shower yet, dude? Now it's at around that water hauling, not towing and recovery or whatever it is. It's still downhill. Oh. They had a smell wonderful. I can't smell, but I imagine the neighbors love it. I mean, that's an all-field trailer. That's that's heavy, just yeah. sitting on its own. But yeah. 
know how much water that would be, but that's... We're gonna find out by... <laughs> oh, I heard you guys got a lot of rain recently. Yeah. I think I know where it all went. I'm glad I didn't leave it full of dirt or scrap or whatever it was. I guess they at least unloaded it. So know there's a trucking company by our yard runs all these trailers and he runs scrap steel. Yeah. But Wisconsin, they could run with a permit. They can run like, like an annual permit. I think they're like a hundred, either 98 or a hundred thousand pounds. Right. I drove the Montana. That's a five axle. I don't think you're running a drop. I drove the Montana probably last year. From here, Albany out. That's all I see is the scrap trailer. Yeah. I mean, constant. Holy. Well, like I was saying, I was on a phone with a guy. He's like, well, you know, it's an end dump. I'm like, okay, a lot of them the hauling dirt, they're aluminum. Yeah. Like, I didn't recognize it'd be a scrap trailer. I'm like, oh, great. Lot oh, steel. It's going to be big and it'll be heavy. But you can't make them out of aluminum if you destroy them right quick. Yep. Yeah, there's like a bunch of leaves up in the front, like brush and shit. I'm like, all right, I guess it'll come out. It's, you see it kind of all caught up. Uh oh. There's a the handle. Well, <laughs> I I tried. Uh, he paid for it. Well, now I have to chain the door closed. Oh, the window hold it closed. I forget it's going backwards. Remember all them leaves and crap in the front? Now it's all that rust color. You know there ain't no paint left on the inside of that trailer. Who else did they get over here to load? Is it just me or who else? Oh, yeah. 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 How'd you climb up in there? Front ladder. I didn't climb in, I just yeah. crawled up ladder, stuck my face over. Yeah, that uh -huh. water gets heavy, man. It was probably three or four feet deep in the front. I mean, look how far you lifted it. Uh -huh. You know, it was level, so figure it, the water stopped at the tailgate. They brought it up, foot out of the ground. Or more. Can you check to see how much is still in there? Do you mind? I can't go a lot higher. I'm going to be out of my skirt. I really don't want to be lifting. You don't want to halt. You don't want to halt with water in it. Nope. around front.
Ah, oh, great. I had to climb up on your... That's good, I can get out now. Oh, that's so loose. Oh, that ain't leaves, that's why. What is it? Steel, burnt up steel. Yeah, this thing is it's not a lot of it though, it's like maybe, I don't know, it's probably like a foot. You know how heavy that is? Not a clue. That's melted steel, that's what I'm saying. I, I, I think you're gonna be overweight. Yeah, it wouldn't surprise me at all. This thing's gonna- And it's gonna be on the ass. And it's saying twice. This thing's gonna weigh about forty thousand. Yeah, I figure forty at the total of it. But don't. The only thing that bothers me now is it's all on the friggin' nose. Yeah, this ain't good. I'm telling you, this is, he hauls that molten <laughs> metal they melt down. Yeah, I don't know how molten it looked like. It's like a bunch of steel that was in a fire. Yeah. I can see a shock absorber over there. Everyone takes their scrap metal, they melt it down and sell it. Is what I'm saying. Right. <sighs> Wonder why it ain't empty. Yeah. Cause there ain't a lot of water left. There's some. Ain't a lot. It's still heavy. Yeah. The the. Look, I, I, yeah. The metals. This is fucking heavy. You know. He's gonna pay me like fifteen hundred to lift this thing on that trailer. Cause this I gotta do a lot of rigging to do it safe. Greasy. So. I don't know. Not, I'm not trying to be a dick. I don't, I don't give a f what you charge them. I, I, sure I charge them extra for being an ass. I want to make sure you can handle it once yeah. on your trailer. I want to load it and then have to unload it because then he ain't going to f***ing pay me. See, it ain't a lot, but it's, you know. No, but it ain't a lot of it either. Well, I don't know how much is a full trailer. I don't yeah. know that's up. Anyway, let me lift it the rest of the way. I just want to see what the hell is what here. Nah, I appreciate that. Yeah, this is not good. Is your trailer split? No. No, it's gonna be over length. And my trailer will be somewhere around here. Right around this area. So these will these will be on the the dollies will be on my back deck. You have to crank them up. Yeah. Might not. Might need a trailer level. Set going down. There we are. That mean that's gonna be So maybe what I could do is get get it beside you, then get beside you and lift the back and set it on. Yes, yeah, either you do the whole come here and lift the front and set it on. Yeah, see I was figuring if you can't lift the whole thing, just put the put that back on the trailer. 
Yeah, like that. Yeah, and, and then put the nose it on it. Put it on the side, the yeah. side, you know what I mean? Why is it going to smooth one way and I don't... We'll smooth the other. There it goes. That's right. I'm gonna be here all day cranking. Uh, it didn't want to do anything earlier though. I don't know why else I cranked one of these. Where are you from? Originally from Jersey. I live in Green Bay now, or near Green Bay. Jersey. Really? <laughs> Everything I like is illegal in Jersey. Right. Hot rod cars and guns. Oh, it worse. Wisconsin is, well, it was better. It's kind of can. Tell me if the back wheels turn. Back one's dragging. Front one. Like I see you got caging bolts in the front axle, not the rear. So we gotta go back to the cage there. Basically. Yeah, they're just dragging, ain't going nowhere. Oh look, I found in the dirt. I found a caging bolt in the ground. Caging bolt. Put them in the back of the brake chambers to hold the brakes off. Here, I'll save you one. Found one in the ground. All right. I'm gonna use these for the fire right? Naturally. You're positive you're good for this, right? Measure it measures out right. All right. I just don't want we could per it's under four it'll come out under 14 and it'll stick eight feet off the ass. I just don't want to get doing all this and then not get paid. You know what I mean? Nah, I totally hear you there. Now we're good. I either draw the short straws or I'm good or crazy. Could be both. That's funny though, the cage two and left two. Well, so it's safe. You know what I mean? They don't want it to roll and hurt nobody. Otherwise, they're in trouble. Just rolls against somebody, you know what I mean? Yeah, but you put the landing legs in the ground, where's it going? Well, I'm just saying it's all for liability. I always take, I always leave at least one on when I leave something. I don't see it moving or I think it's Christian it can. Yeah, it's probably stuck in the room. Yeah, so they make one with a thinner, lesser it's, thread, it's huh? It's finer thread, so it's easier to crank. Oh, yeah. Sure enough. I didn't know they made two threads on. It's loose now. Oh, well, throw this other one in there. I thought I was gonna.
Don't jump, I'm gonna throw this bolt inside. That? Don't jump, damn it, missed again. I said, don't jump, I'm gonna throw the bolt inside. Help even out the weight, there we go. Third time's the charm. Draw some pressure forward. Do I bang on that? On the drum or the... Yeah. Let me pull forward. Pressure. <laughs> All right, try it. There it goes. You good? She's rolling now. Now you want to load this up here or no, down there? I'm going with All right, yeah. It's a little flatter here, but less room. Don't make a difference to me. That leg dragging the ground. That leg's dragging the ground a little. I still think it's going to be too heavy. Let's get her on her and make it happen. If I got to, I know where grandma's house is. myself in the ass by saying this but this is the stuff that kind of separates me from everybody else some people are very uncomfortable with doing stuff like this I am not if it's overweight we could permit it if it's over length over height we could permit it it's definitely not normal what do I do that's normal that's why I, I, uh, I look at it like that's what I do what I do seven people you heard them seven people came to look at this one oh can't do it power only you couldn't even do it because that piece is busted it's got to be hauled or jumped on site i'll haul it they're paying us for it i'll see where record man wants to do this job
Yep. It was obvious. up I'm gonna go too far and I'm gonna come back at it and we get right tight I'm going to back up, tell me when to stop. There we go. Come again? It was measuring on the was sitting over here. It was like 12. Check her again. You gotta measure this plus Bring it up. Can you raise it up? No, we'll just add it. Measure that to the landing gear and then we'll measure it. Right. That. Well, trouble is that lip up there, so it was. I measured from the ground, sorry, from the top, top to the bottom of the gear ish that's right around where it's at Hold that there. go right to that landing gear 144 now measure this I'll measure no, basically 12 huh? basically 12 Yeah, that's three. Well, give me inches, 36. So what, the 144? Yeah. How the hell did I miss? 15 feet. Yeah. How did I f*** that up? So I was We cranked them up too. Yeah. And if we spin it, hang on. No, I mean, yeah, it's the back. I it's the back. It was like 12. Yeah, but that gets the that gets the ass down. Right. Yeah, it's like 12-2. 147. Foot eight. 12-2. 
13, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 13, 10. Yeah, that works that. 